In this exercise, we're going to learn how to update the attribute table of uh, three pieces of thinning that were collected in 2009. I'm going to start off by selecting the features that I want to, uh, whose attribute table I want to edit. So I'm going to click on the first one, hold down the shift key, click on the second one, click on the third one. So we have our three features selected. And now I am going to go into edit mode. Uh, my editor is not visible, so I'm going to go to View, Toolbars, Editor, and then I'm going to go Editor, Start Editing. Make sure that if you have more than one data source that you select the proper one. In this particular case, I want to edit Master Thinning 3. So if you come over here, Master Thinning 3 has to appear here. It doesn't in this case, so make sure you select the proper layer. And it is in this one right here. And I'll click OK. So now we are in edit mode for this layer. I'm going to right click on the layer name, left click on open attribute table. You'll see the three records are selected. Now these were collected on September 18th, 2009. If you look over here, this, the year has not been entered. Um, it is for the rest. This was done by a mathematical calculation. Now, of course, you can manually enter it into each individual one, but if you had a thousand of them, that would be time consuming. It's quite simple to do. All you do is click on the word year with your left mouse button, and then right click on it, and then left click on the word field calculator. From there, you're going to select the type as date, and it's a date part. We want to extract the year. We want to extract the year from this date. So, date part. We click on that, and then we need to do a little bit of typing. I'll click in between the brackets with a flashing cursor. I'll um, double quotations. That's shift single quotes. Then I'll go. Y, 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 Y. We want the year to four digits. I'll close the quotations. I'll put in a comma. And then it wants you to click on the field that is the date. In this case, it's GPS date. I'll double click that. And that is your equation. So now if I come down here and click OK, you'll see that the year has been populated. So when you are done that you have to make sure that you want to save your edits so you go editor stop editing it'll prompt to save your edits you'll click yes and the exercise is done